Hey, what's going on world? It's Mind of an Athlete, it's GodMix.net. This young lady, for those that might not know your story, what's your story and who are you? I'm Ted Cooper, um, class 2015. I just committed to Tennessee not too long ago. Um, my story, I grew up really not liking basketball, mm -hmm. but I started to like it the first, my first game. I did this spin move and everybody was going crazy. So I thought like I could be good at it. And I'm just the type of person that when I'm doing something, I want to be the best at it. And I sucked, I was terrible. I used to run down the court and just throw it off the backboard. I didn't know how to make a layup. And my dad, I asked him to train me and we trained all summer, nonstop. And I started to get the hang of it. And then it just went from there. And I've been training, I train about five times, but it's different stuff. Like I do speed and agility, weights, training, practice team stuff, individual stuff, like it's just continuous all day, nonstop hard work and it's just never a time to relax because it's always somebody else working hard to you. Man, that is wonderful. Um, just hearing you, you say that, that it was nonstop workout. A lot of people say um, hard work pays off. Would you say the hard work, the off season training programs is what's really helped you uh, get to the point you're at now? Of course, hard work really does pay off. Um, I didn't make the USA team my junior, like sophomore, junior summer, between there. And I just worked my butt off till I just couldn't more. And I went to the USA tryouts and I made the team. Um, I started getting ranked. Like, hard work really does pay off for it. Um, who are some of your mentors and role models? Um, my father. Um, my friends, we all work, who all work out with us, um, it's me, Diamond, mm -hmm. Destiny Gibbs, uh, Dominique Wilson from NC State, um, Andrea Carter, all of them. Man, that is wonderful. Uh, for young ladies that uh, don't get the opportunity to, they think, hey, uh, the, some of the stereotypes, what are some of the barriers that you've battled through and overcame as far as in your profession and what you're striving to obtain? Like, what, what, what are some of your goals that you want to do with basketball? Um, I would like to, for basketball to be my job. Um, I want to play in the WNBA. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of stuff that I want to do, but it's a lot of stuff that you got to work hard to do. So it's easier said than done. Um, what, what else did you say? Um, what are some of the barriers, like, you know, some of the stereotypes just growing up uh, that you had to, to deal with and that you feel like, hey, I've overcame and, hey, I've shown that, hey, I belong here? Um... I think rankings, right. like people get caught up in rankings. Right, right. Um, as long as you play hard and you're doing everything you got, I mean, the rankings will come. I mean, I don't think anybody should just worry about rankings. Um, right. I do worry about which colleges are offering a scholarship or a scholarship. Yeah. Um, just got mixed. 